From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon. I'm student meteorologist Dennis Kulov with your Friday evening CNET forecast. Taking a look at the webcams right now across Santa County, we do have mostly cloudy skies in the region thanks to Ian. Um, we do have a temperature of 57 degrees here in State College right now at this hour with a dew point of 45 degrees and winds coming out of the north-northeast at 7 miles per hour. So it is feeling like fall out there across the Center County region. And looking at weather headlines over the next few days, we're going to fe be feeling like fall. We're going to see rain and gusty winds from the remnants of Ian and we'll eventually see a return of the sunny weather. Taking a look at temperatures across the entire Commonwealth, we're generally seeing temperatures ranging from the mid-60s to the low 50s, depending where you're located, so it is feeling like fall out there. And taking a look at the current radar and satellite, we do have cloud cover that is moving in from the south due to Hurricane Ian, and then eventually we'll see um, rain showers moving in from the south later tonight into tomorrow. And then taking a look at the regional view, again, not much going in the Midwest and Ohio Valley, but taking a look at the southeast quad portion of the screen, you can see that there's um, Hurricane Ian making landfall currently in the Carolinas and that rain will be slowly moving into our region over the next few days. So taking a look at the future radar, as you can see, rain will begin to overspread the state by tomorrow morning. So if you have any outdoor plans tomorrow, bring the rain gear as we'll see rain showers continue into the tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening with the heaviest rain concentrated um, across southwest PA. And then moving into Saturday evening into early Sunday morning, we're going to see the rain showers stick around for much of the Commonwealth and eventually we'll see some sunny skies across pushing the northwest state by Sunday evening and then eventually by later next week we'll see the remnants move out and the sunny skies return. Taking a look at the rainfall amounts, the heaviest swath of rain will happen south of Center County. So here in Center County we'll see up to a quarter inch of rainfall but further south you can potentially see one to two inches of rainfall. So tonight we'll see a low of 50 degrees with mostly cloudy skies, rain showers will be moving into the region later this um, to later tonight with winds coming out of the northeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tomorrow, we won't get much warmer tomorrow with a high temperature of 54 with rain and gusty winds. Again, we'll have winds out of the northeast at 10 to 15 miles per hour. So if you're heading outdoors tomorrow, um, especially bring the rain gear out there. Taking a look at the football game forecast, Penn State is playing Northwestern at home. Again, pretty much the entire um, day through tomorrow, through tailgates through the fourth quarter, we'll have temperatures in the low 50s with rain showers and gusty winds. So if you're going to the game tomorrow, bring the rain gear. And again, for your seven day forecast, we'll see the rain showers stick around for Saturday and Sunday, but those will eventually move out by Monday as sunny skies return. And as you can see, as we progress through the week, we'll see mostly sunny skies. So Monday through Thursday will be great for outdoor activities. It'll be pleasant, beautiful, and comfortable. But by Friday, we'll have another strong cold front that moves through. that will um, push temperatures back into the lower 50s. That is your Friday evening CNET forecast. I hope you have a great weekend and a week ahead.